My name is Tyler Bragginson, and I'm an Applications Manager for Hawkridge Systems. Today we're going to be taking a look at a What's New feature in SOLIDWORKS 2016, the ability to lock the Command Manager and other toolbars. In previous versions of SOLIDWORKS, you'd get moving along in a design, and there's a pretty good chance this would happen to you at some point. A quick double-click anywhere on the Command Manager, even on an icon, will result in an undocking and returning to the last place it was positioned when it was undocked previously. If I double-click again, it'll return to the top, or by dragging and dropping on one of the placement arrows, you can go ahead and redock it. Toolbars behave the same way. If you double-click on a toolbar, the toolbar is going to go flying off. To prevent this, SOLIDWORKS 2016 introduces drag points for the Command Manager and toolbars. Now toolbars can only be repositioned by dragging directly on the dots along one edge of the toolbar. For the command manager, it can only be dragged or undocked by grabbing the tabs. If I go ahead and grab a tab, you can see I can undock it. This results in much more predictable behavior and none of those accidental undockings. To go one step further and ensure that our toolbars and command manager don't go anywhere, we can go to our settings, customize, and under our toolbars tab, we can choose to lock the command manager and toolbars. Turning this option on will prevent the toolbars or the command manager from moving even by those drag handles. Now your toolbars and command manager aren't going anywhere unless you go back in and turn off the lock. Today we took a look at the 2016 feature locking toolbars and the command manager. Thanks for watching.